<laughs> yeah, boy. Nope. Yo, what's up, guys? It's me again, Jixi. Hey, <laughs> babalik para sa isa na namang tutorial video. San pa teach me? Nope. Nandito ka ba para makahanap ng chicks? No, 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 no. O nandito ka para maging chicks? Yes, 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 yes. Ara, ara. You came to the right place, boy. Yes. Nope. <laughs> yeah, boy. Nope. First thing on the list is your... Tadaan! The V8 sound card. Um, basically, this is the cheapest one in the market. Um, ito yung pinakamura, kaya ito yung pinili ko. And as you can see, marami siyang buttons and um, knobs, but you won't be using them anyway. <laughs> Gagamitin lang natin dito is yung record music and monitor knobs um basically ito yung magiging connection between your phone and your pc yun yung pinaka purpose niya so for the next one tadaan this is um a micro usb to 3.5 millimeter jack and you really don't have to worry about getting this since free pisha ng V8 sound card most likely most of the live sound card will include this so um, if you want to buy a separate one then you can do so okay you get the two of this from the V8 package so for the next one done um, this is an audio splitter um, 3.5 millimeter jack to two female uh, jacks <laughs> or whatever you call it um, later on gagamitin natin siya as you can see meron siyang mic and uh, headphone ports here yung may mga butas um, later on I explain ko kung paano siya gamitin okay so for the next one ta -da! atong maliit na to is for converting three line jacks to two line jacks um convert natin mamaya yung isang cable ng V8 from three line to two line um para to sa mic and later on kagamitin natin siya so for the last one is this one a normal USB charging cable free din to galing sa V8 package but you can also use any charging cables micro usb to usb so for the next step is kunin mo yung freebie cable uh, remember you get two of, two of these from the v8 package so kunin mo yung isa then pa plug natin siya sa live 1 or live 2 kahit ano dyan pwede mong gamitin so pinili ko yung live 2 kasi wala lang <laughs> and uh, grab the other one yung isang cable i-plug natin siya sa a company instrument port okay so as you can see naka-plug in na siya and it's good to go so, on to the next step. Kunin mo yung cable ng Live 2 or Live 1 na sinaksak mo. And then, grab your audio splitter. And we're gonna plug in Live 2. Remember, Live 2 cable to your mic, um, mic port sa audio splitter mo. But before that, you need to use this one. Okay, remember the audio converter? Okay. So, yung Live 2 cable, 
magkakonvert natin siya from 3 line um, 3.5 mm jack to 2 lines ito yung gagamitin natin para sa mic so ang kapag di mo to ginawa my chance na hindi gumana yung mic okay so just plug it in to your mic port sa audio splitter okay and it's pretty much done so the next one is your a company instrument cable kuni mo siya for this one you won't be using any audio converter so ipasok mo lang siya directly dun sa headphone port ng audio splitter okay ipasok mo lang sige lang yeah boy oh my god okay so as you can see, plugged in the shot and it's ready to go. So, for the next step, as you can see, naka plug na yung headphone ko or headset and yung charging cable sa PC. Okay? So, next step is the open Clanfish. Kung di mo pa alam kung paano i download or install yung Clanfish, I made a tutorial for this. Um, the link is in the description down below. Um, click mo lang yung link. And now, again, to open Clownfish, right click mo lang siya. Then, hover onto the open selection. Click mo yung open. Or just by simply double clicking it. Okay? So, kapag nagawa mo na, may icon na lalabas dito sa lower right corner ng screen mo. Right click mo lang siya. Then, click mo yung set voice changer. Clownfish window will appear. And, ito na yung pinaka voice changer app. Okay? Again, kung di mo pa siya alam kung paano install click on the link on the description down below. I made a tutorial for this. Okay? Again, para makasigurado na naka-install na yung Clownfish drivers, right-click mo on it yung icon sa baba. Okay? Right-click mo lang siya, then hover to the setup. And then choose system integration. Okay. Click Mulansha. Then another window will appear. Okay. So in my case, I installed the SFX mode. Okay. Pero, pedi mo rin gamitin yung ibang integration mode na nandita sa taas. Um, MFX, EFX, GFX, or LFX. But mainly I use. SFX and EFX, okay? Kasi yun yung may um, pinakamagandang tunog out of the choices, okay? So, dito sa listahan sa baba, piliin mo lang kung saan nakalagay yung microphone jack mo, okay? Kung saan nakaplug in. Yung sa akin is nakaplug in sa likod ng computer ko. So, mic in at rear panel. Dito ko in-install yung drivers ng Clownfish, okay? Kung gusto mong palitan yung SFX or any, uh, anything that you chose, uh, click mo lang yung remove button, okay? Then, pili ka ng ibang integration mode, then pindutin mo lang ulit yung install button, okay? After nun, close mo lang yun. And then, again, for girl voice trolling or, um, female trolling just use custom pitch okay only use custom pitch at the preset sa taas is kung gusto mo lang na ibang bosses okay i only use custom pitch with 2.90 um pitch value value <laughs> so highly recommend na wag kang lumagpas ng 3.0 kasi Bus is chipmunk sasha from 2.5 to 3.0 yung range na it recommend ka sa Okay? Delta pa si natin yung pag setup sa clownfish and also sa V8 natin. Let's proceed sa pag setup na ng phone natin. Tada! So, kanin mo lang yung audio splitter kanina. Ito, yung 3 line jack. Oh. And then plug it in to your headphone port okay so here's the most important thing 
lagi mentah pendaan nah, i check mo na yung um, as you can see here yung maliit na headset headset with mic icon okay kasi, minsan pag mali yung kabit mo nito nung audio jack um, may chances na hindi nagro-register yung mic so, ang makikita mo lang dito is yung headphone icon na walang mic okay so, pag walang mic yan hindi gagana yung voice changer mo okay, again for the final check make sure your uh, audio jack is properly plugged in V8 is working properly and then check if there's this headphone with mic icon on the top light top right corner of your screen now para malaman natin kung gumagana yung voice changer sa cellphone natin we're gonna open any voice recording app or screen recording app so in my case i'm gonna open a voice recording app and next thing to do is to just hit the record button so as soon as i talk makikita mo kagad yung linea yung lines na nagalaw so that means my voice is uh, um getting received by my phone okay so to stop this just hit the stop button and then press the recording and then play it back so, as soon as I talk, makikita mo kagad yung linea, yung lines na nagalaw. So, that means my voice is uh, um, getting received by my phone. So, as you can see, gumagana yung voice changer natin. And this means everything is working properly. Now, you can do whatever you want to do, okay? Sana all. Nope. Literally everything in your phone gumagana yung voice changer. So any online games, COD, PUBG, Mobile Legends. Huh? Mobile Legends? Oh. Nope. Kung gusto mo naman sa chat apps like Messenger, Discord, or Zoom, or any other chat apps, gumagana din yan. Okay, so don't you worry. Kung gusto mo naman sa phone calls, I assure you gumagana yan. <laughs> And of course, this voice changer doesn't only work on your phone. Gumagana rin yan sa lahat, as in lahat ng apps sa computer mo. So, you don't have to worry about it. <laughs> so, yeah, that's pretty much it. And I hope may natutunan kayo this in this tutorial. Um, make sure to press that like and subscribe button. Okay? And of course, I'm gonna see you again later. Okay? Happy trolling. Bye! Ara, ara! Wala na akong pera! Nope.